So yummy. Hello everybody. I know, I know it has been too long since I posted a keto diet recipe and I know a lot of you have been asking Ranju can you please please upload a recipe for keto diet. So without any further ado let's just get started. I just got back from the gym. I worked out on my triceps today. I'm so exhausted and honestly super hungry. My stomach is growling. This happens every day by the way. So I'm just going to quickly cook myself some lunch and today I'm in the mood for a kind of a stir fry. That's what I feel like every single afternoon. So in preparation for it, I have chopped some uh, mushrooms here. These are my absolute favorite. I also have chopped some green peppers, about 100 grams of paneer and in this plastic bag I have some spinach as well and while I'm cooking these three I'm thinking I'll chop these and then add it into the pan. Add a tablespoon of butter. As soon as the butter is melted add in the chopped mushrooms. Oh my god mushrooms fried in butter is literally the best thing in the world. Once the mushrooms have melted add in the chopped capsicum or green pepper salt and stir everything together. Once the capsicum is kind of like cooked while it is still crispy, drop in the paneer and stir. My mom got this green chili pickle from somewhere and this has about 2 grams of net carb and it is delicious. It has kind of like a vinegary chili kind of a flavor. That is a big dollop of this chili but it isn't really spicy at all. So I'm just going to keep stirring that. <laughs> okay. It may be a little spicy. <laughs> and finally, drop in the chopped spinach. The spinach takes hardly like two minutes to cook, but yeah, do not forget to stir while that is happening and then you're ready to eat. While this is still hot, serve yourself a plate full of this stir fry. Pour the sauce over because the sauce is amazing. Alright guys, that's it for this video. I will leave the detailed recipe below in the description box. I'll also leave the nutritional value of like how much fat, protein and carbohydrates this recipe contains for this particular portion below in the description box as well. So if you like this video, hit the thumbs up button. If you're new here, please subscribe. That would totally make my day. Also, do not forget to comment down below and let me know if you have any keto diet recipe. Don't forget to share this video with anybody you think might find this helpful. And yeah, I love you guys so much. See you in my next one. Bye.